I had other business ventures. Like I had a ice cream shop and plantation that is no more, mostly because of COVID. Yeah. But uh, that, and I was lactose intolerant. So <laughs> I was lactose intolerant on an ice cream shop. And so it's like, one thing I learned is you have to be passionate about like at least what you're doing. Yeah. And I was, and even when I started this, I wasn't passionate about it, but it, yeah. it grew on me because I became obsessed with like making sure the quality was there and then I could appreciate a good shirt. And so now like it shows in the work, but when there's no love in it, the customer sees that very yeah. quickly. Yeah. Yeah. And then, I mean, like, back to your point where, you know, when our, our company's calling us and, like, yeah, they are. And it's, like, the cool thing is the head of, you know, um, TruSpec or uh, Big Wigs at Vertex and 511, they call us. I didn't call them. And, but, and also when we do call, people return our calls. Yeah. That wasn't always the case. And I think it, it's they respect where we are in the marketplace. Yeah. Um, and they see the value of partnering with us, which, again, is stuff that I would have never had fathomed uh th- th- that we would be that we would be established as that go-to company yeah calling all units calling all units donut shop has a fresh dozen go ahead and take a 1040 